Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a smooth car badge flipping effect easily in After Effects. Before we start making the effect, first make sure that you have stabilized the clip and locked the car badge in the center to make the effect smooth and clean. If you don't know how to stabilize and center it, check the description of this video. I will leave a tutorial link there. Let's begin. First I'll rename my layer to clean to stay organized, and then I'll remove the badge from the car. To remove it, we first need to mask the badge. For masking, I'll use Mocha AE. In Mocha I'll select the ellipse tool and mask out the badge. It doesn't have to be perfect, just create a mask around it like this. Now let's enable perspective, then click the track forward button and wait for it to finish. Once it's done, click save, and then close Mocha AE. Now expand matte and click on create AE masks. Then press M on your keyboard and change the mask mode to subtract. The badge area should be completely black like this, otherwise you won't be able to use content aware fill properly, and it might get messed up. If yours doesn't look like this, double check everything and make sure you're following the video step by step. Let's go to content aware fill and set alpha expansion to zero. I'm setting it to zero because I created a larger mask than the logo, so there's no need to expand the alpha. Change the fill method to edge blend, then click generate fill layer and wait until it finishes removing the badge. Once it's done, check your video to make sure everything is smooth and clean. As you can see Content Aware Fill did a great job in my case. Now I'll duplicate the clean layer and move the duplicate above the fill layer, then rename it to Animation. Press M on your keyboard and delete the mask. Next I'll click Reset under the Mocha AE effect to restore everything to default, then click on Mocha. In Mocha, I'll select the Ellipse tool again and this time mask the badge as smoothly as possible. Once you are done masking, enable perspective, click the track forward button, and wait for it to finish. Once tracking is done, click save, and close Mocha AE. Now expand matte and click on create AE masks. Now make sure you're at the beginning of the layer, press P on your keyboard to reveal the position property, and click the stopwatch icon next to it. Now I'll enable 3D on the animation layer because I want to animate the Y rotation. Next I'll click the stopwatch icon for Y rotation, scroll forward a bit, and move the Y position up. Then I'll set the Y rotation to rotate once. If you want the badge to rotate more, just set it to your preference. Let's scroll forward again, then right click on position and select reset to restore it. Do the same for Y rotation, or simply change it to zero. Now select all the keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Then open the graph editor, right click inside, choose edit speed graph, and create a smooth curve. Now we can check the logo flip effect and see if there's anything else we can add. That looks so cool. I will enable motion blur on the animation layer to add some natural blur, and then I'll add a shake effect for when the badge hits the car. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials, also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description, check how it looks like with my shake presets. Hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching and like the video please.